Hi, welcome back to my channel. Um, today I'm going to do an unboxing video of my new purchase from Louis Vuitton. Um, I actually received the package on Thursday and it is Sunday today so I've been <laughs> waiting for the opportunity to actually film so it's been quite a few days so I'm quite excited. Um, Here is the box that I'll be unboxing. This is going to be a true unboxing because as you can see it's not actually been opened yet. Um, so I've been itching to actually open this but ooh, so here we go so this is how it looks like small box um, and it comes in with this little like a bit of a strip that you can just peel off so I am going to go ahead and do this ooh, I'm a bit shaky and excited so that's it and then I'm going to opens up like that um, this is still but I think if you want to return you just peel this strip off and stick it back in and that's how you return if you if you're not happy with your item uh, so here we go so this is how it comes in to your items so there's these things so it comes with the receipt um, usually it comes, the one that comes in actually is more like a gift receipt so it doesn't actually show you the price of the item so and this is and this is how it hasn't actually got a price on there but it's actually got my address on there so um, usually the next day or so after you receive the item you would get the this envelope which consists your invoice or receipt which actually has the um, price of the item on there um, they just send it separately I, I don't know what the reason is but that's usually what happens they come separately so the one that actually comes in the box um, doesn't have a price on there here's the actual little box it's, it's quite small quite cute the little card um, before I open this <laughs> um, just so you know that all my Louis Vuitton items are, were currently actually made in France um, when I got my Emily wallet I actually thought that was going to be the first made in Spain item I thought oh I'm not going to be so lucky and always get items that are made in France so I thought that one's going to be the one but my Emily wallet was actually made in France so maybe this is going to be my first made in Spain item so we will soon find out so this is how it comes in little box like that tiny and um see if I just take that out the box comes in a little dust bag, says Louis Vuitton, so cute, and when we open it, I'm so excited, I'm actually shaking, um, this is what I got, ta -da! <laughs> the um, Louis Vuitton 6 key holder in the Damier event print, um, I actually got um, the 4 key holder many many years ago, but I found it was just too small and I always ended up having my car key sort of dangling out and that kind of defeated the whole point of having your keys protected that wouldn't scratch the inside of your bags. Um, so I ended up selling that one. Um, and then I bought the clay and took my keys in. But again, my car key was sort of out, um, like it wasn't actually in the actual clay. Um, so I thought, um, I'll give this one a try. And Mimi from Minx Wall really highly recommended this and said how amazing it was. Uh, so I thought, um, I'll give it a try. So here it is. Smells nice. <laughs> so I'm gonna just open it up and <laughs> oh my god, it's actually made in France. <laughs> I can't believe I'm so lucky to have all my Louis Vuitton items actually made in France. I'm I'm so happy. I just honestly thought the the first S, this is gonna be the first SLG in made in Spain, but it's made in France, so I'm not I'm not gonna complain at all. It won't get returned either, I don't think. <laughs> Um, so it's got the six rings, um, it's got Louis Vuitton written there at the top. Um, I think you can move this to take these rings out but I haven't actually figured out um, how to do that yet. Um, it's one piece of canvas at the back, so it's all the way, six keys and it's actually got a little slip pocket inside here that you can maybe put some money in or I think it fits like your credit cards in there or something as well but I don't know how many you can actually fit in um, I know the date coat's also inside this bit but I think it's quite difficult so there's actually something in there it's got the little card the little 
card that comes with Lunar Town, so... It's quite soft already. I don't know whether that just means the canvas is actually thinner than um, where it used to be, but it feels very soft already, like quite squidgy. The main thing I wanted to know about this was whether it actually fits my car key in, so I'm going to put my car key in for now. I'll put the rest of my keys later on, but I just wanted to see if it will close with my car key on, so I'm just going to go ahead and do that. So what I've done is I just... I'm, I'm not going to leave that ring on there, but I just um, can't bother to take it out right now. I'll probably just hook it on the actual key itself. So if I do, um, and then try to close it, it it does close, but I, I know the, the big ring that I left on is going to be in the way, so I'll be taking that off. And But it fits, and I can close it, and hopefully if I fit my other keys in there, it will close with no problems as well. Um, I do have quite a few keys. I've got like two keys for like the house um one of them is actually like a chub key so it's quite big and uh, i've got one for a key for my parents house that i can have access to <laughs> and i've got like three keys for um like the office when i go to work so there are quite a few keys that i need to get in that to get fit in here so i'll see how that goes hopefully it'll all fit um with louis vuitton slgs you can um get them hot stamp with your initials um, but I, even though I'm not planning to sell it, I don't want to be, sort of have the limit um, and not be able to sell it if I wanted to one day. So I, I haven't had mine hot stamped or anything. But um, they also do this in the monogram print. Um, I did see one that was in the monogram print that you could choose the fuchsia interior. I think the same as my Emily Lou Wallet was like fuchsia on the inside and the button will be like, the fuchsia and leather as well. Um, I kind of did want sort of everything to look a bit the same and... I think the fuchsia looks very special on the wallet, so I didn't want every all the other items to be samey, if you see what I mean. So um, I picked something else, and I always like the Damier Ben quite so a bit. I'm quite um, happy with this. Um, it looks really good, and it's very small. Um, it'll fit in my bag very nicely. And um, if you've seen my previous video on the Emily wallet, um, I'm using the clay with the Emily wallet, so I do need something to put my keys in, which is this one. So that's my first um, impression of it, and sorry it was such a quick rushed unboxing, because this is like the only opportunity I, I had to do it, otherwise I probably would have had to wait until like next weekend, because I've worked during the week, and I thought even though with the low lighting and it's very grey outside, I thought I'm just going to quickly do it, because I can't wait to use this. Um, I can always do a review on it and um, once I've started to use it properly and see if all my other keys fit in it as well. Um, so we'll see how it goes. Um, yeah. So thank you for watching my unboxing and um, I will see you all guys on my next video. Be sure to have a unique day today. See you later. Bye. You're kind of in the way. You noticed. <laughs>